epic 10 list. From beer companies trying to get into the bottled water business and Microsoft trying to compete with the iPod, here are the 10 worst product fails of all time. Number 10, water for animals. Thirsty Cat and Thirsty Dog brands believed there should be a water brand for animals. Some of the flavors included crispy beef and tangy fish. Unfortunately, dogs and cats never really caught on to the idea and they continued to drink out of puddles and occasionally sniff and lick their own feces. Number nine, Singles by Gerber. Baby food for adults? Mashed up beef burgundy and a sprinkling of Mediterranean flavor? No adult wanted to be caught eating mashed up food when this released in 1974. According to this failed product, adults like using their teeth. Number eight, cocaine. Cocaine, the energy drink, was pulled off shelves by the FDA as being marketed as an alternative to drugs. It has three times the caffeine of a Red Bull. Number seven, Cosmo Yogurt. While the magazine brand, Cosmopolitan, is international, its yogurt only lasted about 18 months at grocery stores before being pulled off shelves. Number six, Coors Rocky Mountain Sparkling Water. Coors thought that its ice cold beer, brewed from the ice cold mountain water, could be its entry point into the bottled water business. The product ended up failing. I mean, who wants to sit there at work drinking an ice cold Coors? Well, I guess a lot of people do, but it may be sending the wrong message to your employer. Number five, Wow Chips. Using a chemical produced by Procter & Gamble called Olera, Wow Chips by PepsiCo made their debut as a healthier snack choice. Yet Olera led to digestion issues and in some cases, hospitalization. The chips were pulled as lawsuits broke out. Number four, New Coke. In 1985, Coca-Cola decided to redesign their drink with a new formula. The shock of this rippled consumption as people wanted the classic version. If it ain't broke, then don't fix it. Number three, the Microsoft Zoom. While iPod held about 86% of the market, the Microsoft Zoom desperately competed for its market share. It lost over $3 billion for Microsoft. Number two, Arch Deluxe. Do you remember when all those fast food joints started marketing their gourmet burgers? Well, McDonald's did that a bit prematurely in an advertising campaign that showed kids disliking their adult form of a burger. Except the $100 million dumped into the marketing wasn't enough to convince adults to pay $2.29 at a time when the Big Mac was only $1.90. Number one, the Newton Pad. Talk about premature, from 1993 to 1998, Apple released the Newton Pad, the first handheld computing device with a handwriting feature. At the time, critics slammed the device as an expensive replacement for paper. Hey guys, thanks for watching this episode of Epic 10 List. Is there a failed product that we missed? Be sure to let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up. See you next time.